Hi, my name is Sean Seymour with Simpson Strong Tie, and I'd like to thank you for joining us. As you can see from our list of titles, we have many short videos available to help you stay fresh and on top of your game when selling and designing decks using our Deck Tools software. You can search for these titles by name on YouTube, or feel free to subscribe to our channel by clicking on the subscribe button above. Let's go ahead and get started. Nudging Wall and Deck Elements when the grid snap option is on, wall and deck segments will snap to the default 12 inch grid. To adjust the wall dimensions by smaller increments, use the nudging function. First, select the deck or wall you would like to nudge, and then click the segment to highlight just that element. Use the arrow keys on your keyboard to nudge the element. Keep in mind, the nudge direction will be in the direction of the arrow relative to which design view window you're working in. Using the arrow keys moves the element one inch with each nudge. The shift key plus the arrow key increases the distance to one foot with each nudge. The alt key plus the arrow key defaults at one eighth inch but is a programmable distance you can set for your own specific needs. Open the Info Tabs pane and select the Settings tab and then expand the Design View section. Use this menu to set any distance for the key combination. I appreciate your time and hope you found this video helpful. Remember, you can search for these videos by name on YouTube or subscribe to our channel by clicking on the subscribe button. We are also on Facebook if you'd like to stop by and take a look at our page. We understand that these videos cover some of the basics. If at any time you need additional training or support, please feel free to email us at support at decktools.com. My name is Sean Seymour with Simpson Strong Tie, and statistically there will be 3 million decks built in the United States in 2013. We look forward to hearing about your successes. Thank you.